Buying a new home is an exciting time in anyone's life, especially if you're a first-time home buyer or moving to a new part of town. You've got a new living area to decorate and you might be wondering where to begin. Imagine your home surrounded with all the comfort and style you've always dreamed of. In this video, we'll share nine interior design tips that will help you style the home of your dreams. Hi, I'm Angela Margle, interior designer at Lazy Boy Southeast, here in our Lexington, South Carolina gallery. We've helped thousands of new home buyers at our locations in North Carolina, South Carolina, and Georgia. Here's a quick overview of the tips we'll be discussing in this video. Clean out your old home. Measure your new rooms. Sketch your room layout. Visualize your new furniture. Get free interior design advice. Invest in primary pieces. Choose your fabrics before you paint mix and match, and set up landing places. Cleaning out your old home is a great way to take stock in your current belongings. Make a list and itemize things that you want to keep and things that you're willing to let go of. You can get a fresh start by getting rid of items that you no longer use. Items that are in good condition can be donated or sold online with apps such as Craigslist, eBay, or Let Go. And the best thing is you can use this money towards the purchase of your new furniture. Plus, cleaning out your old home will make the moving process much easier. You'll have less to pack and more room in your new home. Get out your tape measure so you can measure your new rooms. I recommend putting the dimensions into your phone. That way you'll always have them with you when you need them. And while you're at it, take pictures of the spaces you're updating. You can use these pictures later as reference or whenever you need them. To start with, get an overall measurement of the length and width of the room. Put your tape measure on the floor, measuring from baseboard to baseboard. Then you'll want to measure the walls, the door openings, and the windows. Knowing these dimensions will help with your room layout. Now that you've got your room dimensions, you can sketch your room layout. These sketches don't have to be perfect. Start with a square or rectangle, depending on the shape of your room. Transfer the dimensions to your sketch, and be sure to note the door openings, windows, and any architectural features such as your fireplace. Now that you have your room sketch, you can visualize your new furniture. Try a couple of different furniture layouts to see what you like best. Take your sketch and your room dimensions with you. Make sure you measure furniture pieces that you're interested in for width, height, and depth. Then when you get back home, you can measure again to see if these pieces will fit. Furniture shopping can be complicated and overwhelming. There's such a wide variety of design styles, furniture combinations, and options available it might be time to seek out advice from an interior designer. At Lazy Boy Southeast, you can work with any of our degreed interior designers at our locations in North Carolina, South Carolina, and Georgia for free. Our in-home design program is completely personalized and a free service that is tailored to your individual taste, lifestyle, and budget. Of course, you can always seek out advice from family and friends. Just make sure they're aware of your personal design style and taste. If you like these design tips and you wanna hear more, hit your subscribe button down below. Your largest upholstery pieces, such as your sofa, love seat, or sectional, are a focal point in your room and your biggest investment. I would recommend choosing a neutral color, focusing on solids and textured fabrics, as well as timeless styles. That way you can build around them as your style evolves. Primary pieces in a timeless style and neutral color will allow you to get the most for your investment. If you choose your paint color before you pick your fabrics, you might pin yourself in a corner. It's much easier to pick a paint color from your fabrics than the other way around. At Lazy Boy Southeast, we have hundreds of fabrics to choose from, and then there's an infinite amount of paint colors to choose from. Your Lazy Boy designer can help you pick the perfect paint color to complement your fabrics. Or you can take your fabric samples to a paint store, just look for something that complements your fabrics, and don't be afraid to ask for help if needed. Don't be too concerned if colors don't match perfectly. When everything in a home matches, it becomes repetitive and bland. Let your personality shine through by mixing colors, fabrics, and textures in each room. Start with a common theme or color, and then add window treatments, rugs, and accessories to complement them. You can update accessories as your style or the season changes. This will keep your home feeling fresh and updated for years to come. Make a good first impression by keeping your entryway organized and neat. When people get home, most of us just toss our keys and hang up our coat. So make a landing places for these items. Get creative and make a custom coat rack, or you can use decorative boxes or baskets for things such as keys and cell phones. 
By having a designated place for these items, you're a little less likely to lose them. We're so excited for you and your new home. At Lazy Boy Southeast, we make designing your home fun and easy by giving you access to a degreed interior designer for free. You can click the link in our description to learn more. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe and be on the lookout for more design tips that help you live life comfortably.